In March of 2008, my daughter Eloise was diagnosed with rhabdomyosarcoma. We were so incredibly stunned to know that our child who'd been jumping off diving boards and riding horses six months prior was diagnosed with cancer. Having followed the one-year protocol for her treatment, she was claimed to have no evidence of disease. We enjoyed those next six to seven months until she complained of numbness in her tongue. She completed a year of treatment and was at seven months remission. It was diagnosed, re-diagnosed as recurrent rhabdomyosarcoma. Through a course of meetings with her doctors and professionals, we were given the grim news that she would she fit into a 2% chance of survival. In the course of those conversations, one fact kept ringing in my ears, and it was the fact that doctors had been telling families like us uh, this same diagnosis for 30 years. The 30 years was just so difficult to comprehend. It was so surprising to me that the research had been stalled for so long and that they were not able to come up with better forms of treatment for cures for children with cancer. That impacted me greatly and impacted my family greatly and impacted my, my friends, her friends. Um, we were able to treat her with a palliative and then hospice care. She passed away in May of 2010. At that point in time, I became very passionate to find a cure for cancer and was introduced to the Cure Search community. I was fortunate to have several friends that were very helpful in helping research childhood cancer organizations. Cure Search constantly rang out as the most successful and innovative organization. Cure Search has an outstanding group of scientists researchers, doctors, and professionals in which all of us are working tirelessly to find a cure for children's cancer. There is a drive to push forward, uh, to push forward for these children. I have a surviving daughter, and for her and her friends and my nieces and nephews, all of which will be having families of their own in years to come, we need to make a difference.